get here another steam up and then discard everything is that a KO? I don't know hopefully it is I didn't count it is perfect mass yeah 340 damage take that eternatus so hello guys welcome back to the channel and today we will be taking a look at uh evolving skies volcarona v so volcarona v has 210 hp with two attacks weakness to water and with three cost of two with first attack for a fire energy surging flames does 20 damage and this attack does 20 more damage for each basic energy card in your discard pile then shuffle those energy cards back into your deck so in my idea uh, this attack is very um, underwhelming in the standard format so let's go to uh, I tried to uh, build it in expanded since we got a lot of support for Volcarona V's surging flames attack so uh, before we move on now we have this second attack fire blast 160 damage for two fire and a colorless energy and then discard an energy from this pokemon so this is a very good uh attack uh gu guaranteed two hit ko to those v maxes except uh the rapid strike urshifu the 340 hp eternatus v max and this build will focus so, uh, mostly on the surging flames so how do we discard those energies well we have a lot of ways to discard fire energies which is in this deck we play a lot 16 fire energies since if we calculate it 16 energies with uh, no, 16 energies but we can only discard a maximum of 15 since uh, we'll be using one for for the surging flames we will deal 300 damage but it's really not 300 damage at most we can boost that with Volcanion EX Volcanion EX ability steam up allows you to discard a fire energy card from your hand and if you do your basic fire Pokemon's attacks do 30 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon so uh, theoretically Volcarona V uh, discarding 15 energies in a discard pile with three of them discarded with a steam up of Volcanion EX we could deal 390 damage now that is a one hit KO on anything in the in the game right so we also have here two the Denny GX for the day change and one Crobat V. Now we have here a Duskull. Duskull is very useful for its spirit born evolution. Once during your turn, you may discard three cards from your hand, and if you do, search your deck. We we don't have any evolution. We just play it for the discard effect, the discard three cards effect. This is a very good card in the late game when we used up all of our resources and then this is a very last ditch effort now you could um, you, you can up to swap this with the fourth copy of a Volcanion EX but I really like the addition of Duskull since if we exhaust majority of our resources we could opt to use Spiritborn Evolution and discard energies from our hand so also here we play four battle compressors since it is the best item card to disc discard something out of your deck search your deck for up to three cards and discard them shuffle your deck afterwards we play two fiery flints since uh you can at uh, least allows you to have a robust energy search uh discarding two cards from your hand and then you search your deck for up to four fire energy cards then we play two fiery torch you could uh, play f a full play set of this fire torch the item is very good discard a fire energy card from your hand and if you do draw two cards so this is another way to uh, discard your fire energy and which I think is very good 
So we play full playset of Quick Ball since we all are uh, all our Pokemon's are basic and two copies of Ultra Ball for that additional discard. We don't pl we won't play here Nest Ball because um we uh, Nest Ball puts uh, basic Pokemon di directly from the deck to the bench and we don't have that discard effect and we, c we c you could swap this with a four playset of Ultra Ball and then two Quick Balls but I like the proportion between the Quick Ball and the Ultra Ball we have four versus Seekers to uh, retrieve our retrieve our supporters from the discard pile we have one Heat Factory that allows us to discard another fire energy then draw three cards and three copies of scorched earth which it, which allows an, another discarding of fire energy then draw two cards so this deck has a lot of uh, draw power and a lot of discarding which i think is a very uh consistent way to uh, attain maximum damage of surging flame uh, Volcarona V's surging flames we play one copy of blacksmith uh, for the uh, emergency fi fire blast in case we need it and in case when Volcanion EX uh, needs to attack which is not a bad attacker at all volcanic heat deals 130 damage and this Pokemon can attack during your next turn this is a very good attack when a very good backup attacker when your opponent plays uh the Sijuai V since the Sijuai V a uh, the Sijuai V the Sijuai the deep camo forest the Sijuai is immune only fr from uh Pokemon V and Pokemon GX and since Volcanion is a Pokemon EX Volcanion can damage the Sijuai so I think the Volcanion EX is still a very good attacker a very good option plus it's a uh, fire and water who, do who does not who doesn't love that so we play one copy of boss's orders and one copy of Guzma for August. We play a mix of those depending on the situation since we have four copies of Versus Seeker, that's a no problem. We play two copies of Cynthia, two copies of Professor's Research for the discarding, and one copy of Welder. Just in case uh, we need to attack with uh, Fire Blast first turn. We play two copies of Floatstone for the retreat. And there's no uh, d there's no damage modifier with, for this thing. We solely rely on the steam up of Volcanion Volcanion EX. So I think that pretty much covers the uh, deck profile. In my opinion, this deck has a pretty good match up with uh, ADP. That's why we don't play Ranger since we could easily, hopefully, we could easily. KO ADP before uh, after the alter creation before the ultimate ray and then Zacian V is weak to fire so but uh, you can put Pokemon Ranger if you want I don't know what to cut though since uh, 16 energy is what I really need to get into the 300 damage uh, threshold so yeah let's see some matches and we'll see if the deck really works Okay, so lo let's start uh, playing some Volcarona. Volcarona, Volcarona. We're going against Kazunoku. Hmm. I hope you're not some toxic Ultra Necrozma deck. <laughs> Man, I hate going against those kind of decks. It just I know it's fast, it's consistent, but man, it's just too toxic. Okay, so Dust Call on the start, not bad. Hmm, more shadow. Are we going against Shadow Rider? Hmm. Looks like it is. And I think if they'll be playing Acerola, then we're, we'll, ha we'll have a very big problem way ahead of us. 
Okay. So, what do we have here? I think we'll play f this first. Then we get nice. We get this one. We play the stadium first. Then we discard these two. Get ourselves. Uh, I think we'll go with a uh, Volcarona. Oh no, we prize two of our Dedene and one Volcanian. So, how many energies did we prize for? We prized one energy. Okay. Cool. We'll discard. We don't need to discard a lot because we'll just try to KO more shadows. So, I think we'll discard our blacksmith, one of our gust, and then another energy. I think that will be fine. Because we need to, t to still draw an energy out of this. Okay, good. Um, hmm. Yeah, I think we'll bench this. We'll bench this. And then, we will attach here. And then, knock out Marsh Shadow. Can we? Can we do it? That's 60 plus 20, 80. That's good. That's enough. Shuffle those back. Heat factory. Hmm. I don't want to discard that. Okay, good thing. We'll put some value with the heat factory out of this. Marnie, it's very bad. That's really bad. You know, we need another stadium. And we don't have that. Can we knock it out though? No, we can't. Since we ne really need our abilities. Hmm. I think we'll just thin out the deck. Discard more energy. And then we'll thin them out. We we don't have any recovery for that Volcanian, so yeah. That's bye bye Volcanian. I we have one price still. Um we'll attach here since we might use fire blast go surging flames for a hundred damage okay oh that's bad now that could buy them some turn okay so Underworld door, and then I think they m they will attack me. Hmm. We still have two more battle compressors, high retorch. Yeah, that's for sure. A hundred damage fine I guess we'll attach here and then we'll just play fire blast the next turn we still don't have a knockout yeah hmm this is bad I think they play acerola Let's hope not though. Hmm. A 
another Shadow Rider coming out. Underworld door. It's good that they didn't play that uh, Mist uh, Psychic Mirage variable. And there it is, the Acerola coming out. Oh boy. So I think they'll have a knockout here. And that's bad. Oh boy. The only way we can win against this thing is when we one hit KO a Shadow Rider. But in this case, I don't think we can. I don't think we can. Yeah. So I think we'll just concede here and move to another game. And hopefully, we'll encounter some decks that uh, don't have much healing. So let's move on to the other match. Let's try to get some wins here. Hmm, another Shadow Rider. Now leave me some suggestions below what decks to make in expanded. Now I love making expanded decks. You know, uh, what decks could we make for next week? Um, I think we'll start with Volcanion. Yes. And then... We'll be having some Mulligan. No, it's Blissey. Okay. I think we have a very good pretty good matchup against Blissey. Since uh, you know, Blissey they might be playing a tons of healing, but uh usually we only need to take uh K take KO of three Blisses. So in here we play Volcarona. I think I'll retreat this ahead. Yeah. Then um get myself a fiery torch. Yes. Another Volcarona Volcarona will bench that. We'll discard Blacksmith. Since we have Versus Seeker we can we can take uh, we can get it back. We'll get Volcanion. We'll play Scorched Earth since they play Path to the Peak. Good. I think we're good enough. Now, if they play that Path to the Peak, we have Heat Factory to counter it. And then, hopefully, by next turn, we can take a KO in this Blissey V. Blissey V takes a. Uh, a lot of momentum before it gets going. There it is, the path to the peak as expected. Hopefully, not a, uh, no Marnie, please. We don't want our heat factory to go at the bottom of our deck. Research, that's fine. They discard two uh, lucky energy, and I think they'll be discarding here three more double colorless. Now, if they don't bench another Blissey. I think we could win the game. Yes. Cape of Toughness. Yeah, we don't play a field blower in this list so because we really rely on uh, taking a one hit KO beyond 300 damage. So, let's uh, put our uh, aggression. Assert our aggression here. We I think we play first the fiery torch there it is let's put this here we'll play the heat factory we'll discard more energy discard more energy
play Crobat. Grab those energies. We can't, but we could steam up. And then play Research. Hoping to get more energy to discard. There it is. Steam up. Is it enough though? 11. Nope, not yet. Discard more of these. Discard these. Get another Volcanian. We don't have any more energy. And then steam up. And then surging flames for KO. 370 damage. <laughs> So yeah, that's a good thing about this deck. Oh boy, let's move to another match. So we're going against Shaoran PTCG with a money box. I wonder what their deck will be. Okay, so... Hopefully we go second. Uh, no, we we'll go first. And starting with Crobat. Not bad, I think. Um, we have we have things to play with in here. Ooh, Wally and Electrode. Hmm. They might be playing uh, Garchomp, Giratina, Dunk. So I think we need to get at least uh, three Pokemon in play because we'll be al in a lot of trouble if we don't get three Pokemon in play. Okay, so we play this first, then we get ourselves. Hmm. Let's play this. What can we get here? Nope. We discard energy. Because um, most likely they'll be uh, playing Wally next turn, so we need to get at least three Pokemon so that we won't be out of the game. And that's why it's dangerous to venture your venture into the expanded world because you might encounter a lot of decks like these. Don't worry, um, we still have four versus seekers in the deck. We can get those back nice and I think we're safe for now so now yeah that's what I'm talking about Electro GX tra will try to uh, put energy to the Mew copy Giratina's uh, GG and discard two of my Pokemon and then there's game. So hopefully that uh, helped you uh, give you some in information in the world of Expanded. So let's move to another match. Let's see how many wins can we get. So far we have uh, two wins already with the deck. So, I won the coin flip and I will go second. We want that uh, turn one going second KO, right? So, let's try to do that. Hopefully, they're not fast raid decks. I hate fast raid decks. No, they're not. Oh! So, I think it's already over, guys. <laughs> it's already over. We play this. Yep. They know. They know. 50 coins. What deck are they playing? Nope. Can't see. So, I think... Hmm. We'll go two more games with the deck. Because uh, this has been a very quick matches for the deck. We want to see those turn one going second 300 damage with a Volcarona. 
we we run against again shower run ptcg oh boy this time we'll go second i think this was the uh oh interesting start this is bad <laughs> i think this is the blissy deck right no it's a diff did they use another deck oh wally the electro gx deck i think yes the one we just uh, defeated by benching three uh four pokemon here it is a mew it's coming out that's good so we don't want that mew so we'll try to boss it and then we will get ourselves a crobat hopefully it's not priced it's not priced good because we need the momentum here nope they concede again <laughs> okay so you see guys this is a very good deck in uh, speed running your uh, expanded ladder if you want to get that uh, full art rosa as the time of recording this video or maybe in the future ladder you might wanna uh, go fast with a lad uh, with a ladder so the Dene starting with the Dene they play dragon sleeves and dragon deck box this might be ADP or uh, ultra necrozma I think you'll have a pretty pretty bad matchup with the ultra necrozma since uh, we don't have a field blower you, you can play it but I chose not to Be uh, because you rely on abilities to discard your energy you only have a limited uh, this deck only has a limited number of items to discard your energy so good thing we have uh, scorched earth and fiery torch in our hand we can thin our deck before we ultra ball a uh, quick ball for uh, uh, the Dene if we don't get a supporter out of these uh, Scorched Earth and Fiery Torch. Dark Eternatus. Mm. Okay, that's good. Viridian is good. <laughs> So are they gonna retreat Corobat? Then feed me their Eternatus? Let's see here. Another Corobat. Probably for the next turn. So here we find welder. I think we'll attach the welder. Uh, we'll we'll play welder for the for the retreat of the Dene, and then we play this. No, we play this. That's good. And then we welder. Attach here. Um, I kinda don't want to discard my two stadiums. <laughs> we'll attach here for sure. Hmm. Um, how?
how how di how much damage are we dealing here? One, two, three. We discard this for five. Hundred, hundred twenty. Um, that's still a sh hundred fifty. That's still short of a knockout. Hmm. Do I have Crobat? Let's play this here. Yes, we do. And then we play this. Get a Volcanion. Because we want to take early prizes. Because for sure, there are, there's a high chance that uh, Eternatus is gonna KO me next turn. There it is. We'll, let, we'll, we'll bench that. And then. Go here. It's good. So we're doing 5, 120, 140, still 170, that's st still short of a knockout. 4, 5, 6, 6, they play They play Viridian. So I think it's fine. Okay, good. We'll play this here. And then go Surging Flames for 250 damage. Dowsing machine, that's good. Energy is good. Okay, so I think we could dowsing machine for the. Uh, what can we get with the dowsing machine? I think we'll we'll get again the battle compressor. So I think they're going here. Oh, they play Weavile. I have a bad feeling about this since they could move freely the energy and play max potion. And this deck is very weak against healing decks. Oh, a Bridget, that's very weird. In a very weird play in an Eternatus deck. Oh, they also play. Okay, that's a KO. Good. Fine, I guess. Okay. Okay, so our stadium stick. Let's discard energies first. Discard these. Then. Oh, we got research. That's good. Um, we play this, we get another, uh, we get back the compressor or the fiery flint. I think we'll go with the fiery flint because we can get so many energies to the discard pile with professor's research. Yeah, I think I'll go with that play. Then we'll steam up. A boost. And then we get here another steam up. And then discard everything. Is that a KO? I don't know. Hopefully it is. I didn't count. It is! <laughs> Perfect math! Yeah! 340 damage. Take that, Eternatus. <laughs> yep. 
with just one hit KO the Eternat an Eternatus V Max with a Volcarona V. That's hilarious. <laughs> so we're down uh we have one prize remaining and I think we're still in a good in a good position. We have supporter for the turn, that's good. Another fire energy is good. And another fire energy. Okay, good. All good, all good. We still have two more battle compressors. So I think it's it's not it's not bad. They'll go with another Eternatus. Hmm. Do they have a Dark Patch and a Weavile GX? Lily. Hmm. Interesting. Great Ball for another Dark Light EX. And I think that would be game, folks. If we can pull it off okay let's discard these for four energy and then we power steam a uh, steam up power steam that's a power steam we'll play this fail it just to discard these uh, energies and then we'll play Cynthia since we're bench luck. And then we discarded this one. And then discard everything. I think that's a KO. Yes. 280 damage. You gotta love Volcarona. And that would be all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you'll tune in next week for another expanded deck. I'll leave your suggestions below and your thoughts to this deck. Uh, thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Oh, wait. We can buy a pack from the shop. Okay, screw that uh, outro. <laughs> We'll open up this one. And then, yeah, we'll conclude the video here with a pack opening. Hoping to get some ultra rares. So, leave your suggestions below for next week's deck. And <laughs> another Neuvern. Okay, I'll take it. Thank you so much for watching, and see you next time.